Here's an expansion appliance I'm making using the 036 Beta 3 titanium alloy wire. Now this is a continuous wire and I like this because both the lingual arms and the active part of the appliance are titanium. Just makes it a nice flexible appliance. It's a little tricky on the wire bending but it makes a real good appliance. Uh, since titanium cannot be soldered or spot welded to the lingual of the bands what I did was I crimped the wire and put it into a lingual sheath. Now if you're going to have this as a fixed removable appliance you just remove the appliance and spot weld the lingual sheath to the lingual of the bands and then insert the appliance and you'll be pretty much ready to go. This particular doctor wants the wire to be attached firmly to the band so I'm going to solder it as it is to the band and the solder will go inside the lingual sheath and lock this titanium wire in it so it will become a fixed appliance. Now here's a piece of leftover wire I've got and I'll show you how I anneal that wire. Now the annealing process is simply heating it up and allowing it to cool slowly so that it uh, takes the stresses out of the wire and it toughens up the wire. So I'm going to heat it up and then I'm just going to take my finger and just kind of push it down some. That'll get it down to there. Now I'm going to hold it with another plier, pair of pliers here. And then I'm using this pair of pliers I got from a hardware store. It's serrated on both sides. So any kind of pliers you have that are serrated on both sides will work. And the serration is good because it'll really grab it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to heat it up and then I'm going to pinch it and smash it. So get it good and, good and hot. And you want to keep that heat confined just to the area that's going to go inside the lingual sheath. I, I can do it again. Now I'm crimping it. So there you go. So that will slide into the lingual sheath and then I can adapt the wire so that it becomes this expander. So there you have it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.